Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So earlier today, I let you know that late on Friday in my region, Microsoft rolled out Edge version 132, which is now the latest stable version. And I'll leave the video for that link down below and in the end screen, if you'd like to go check out that more in depth. Now, just to let you know about another small change that rolled out with version 132 that was brought to my attention in the comments earlier today. And I'm always grateful when viewers of the channel um, make me aware of little tweaks and adjustments after updates that sometimes I can miss. And this was spotted by at Jeff Brown 66. Um, that's the user who let me know about this. Where in the new release of Edge, uh, in the page colors under appearance, there's a new option called Aquatic. Now, page colors, um, if we just head to our settings, is an accessibility feature uh, in the browser, which is found on the accessibility page, or you can head to the appearance page, and you will, yeah, we've also got page colors. So it's an accessibility feature that makes sites easier to read by modifying the colors you see on those pages. And I'm always in favor of accessibility features um, that are rolled into any browser or operating system. And I'll leave the previous video where I actually showed you how this all works, um, linked down below and in the end screen. But just a quick update. So the new feature is, if we toggle that off because it, it will only work and apply page colors when high contrast themes are on. If that toggles on, um, that's when these page colors will only show. But I'm gonna leave that off because I wanna just get to the get cut to the chase here so to speak so we've got off we've got dusk which was there previously desert night sky white and the new one now is aquatic which just looks like a black and a white contrast there we go aquatic is the latest um page color that's been added to page colors, which makes sites easier to read, as mentioned. And that's a little tweak and adjustment that has rolled out in the latest stable release of Edge version 132. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.